and the big reveal of the countertop. But they were very good, very happy with my creation. This year is just tiring. <laughs> All right, I had my acupuncture, but I didn't take you because it's the same thing every time. I got home. I wanna show you a bit of product later, but I'm making dinner right now and I'm making cauliflower tacos. This is my situation. I'm like kind of using a half-baked harvest recipe, but I actually like didn't have half the ingredients. So we're just kind of going with the flow here. So it's cauliflower, there's some onion in there, and then I'm actually using, couldn't find like just straight chipotle peppers. So I'm using like a chipotle mayo sort of situation. I guess it's not a sort of situation. It like fully is a situation that is chipotle mayo. And then I'm using like this green enchilada sauce. Didn't, it called for like chipotle peppers and red enchilada sauce. So we're just working with what we have. Hopefully this tastes good. So that's pretty much everything that's in here right now. And I'm just cooking it up. And then you're supposed to like put it in the oven and stuff, but I'm just not gonna do that. I just have some tortillas here. I'm gonna make like a guac sort of. Yeah, I'm gonna make a guac. And then that's really, it's gonna be really simple just like a nice guac with the cauliflowers on top and then some garlic or coriander cilantro sprinkle that on top and that's really it for din i'll let you know if it's good because i'm just really winging it here i fucking accidentally grabbed the pan too low and my finger is burnt off now that's good but otherwise it's going well other than my fucking finger that burns oh my god Update, they were very, very good, and I'm holding ice on my fucking finger. But they were very good, very happy with my creation. Huh. Yum. So my finger hurt really badly last night, so I put an onion on it, as you can see. In between here, there's onion. <laughs> I'm gonna take it off. See if it worked. I saw it on Reddit. I think it actually did. This doesn't hurt at all. That's so fucked. I'll talk to you more about it when I have my coffee, but my burn is like, doesn't hurt at all. What? That's so crazy. Good morning. Fingers good? Or just grab some, you grab a chai at Starbucks. Okay, I almost just choked. I have two videos that I need to film. Well, I need to film a video actually, and then I need to take an Instagram, and then I need to go to the office. So it's about 10.30. I'm thinking I can get this done by 11.15 and then get to the office by 11.30. That's the plan. Let's get her done. All right, I am done, but I actually did get a few pieces from Missouri that I wanted to show you before I leave and go to the office. This video is sponsored by Missouri. You guys know I work with them all the time. I literally wear their pieces every day. Today I am wearing my little Huggies here and then I have my diamond huggy. I have these earrings in literally all the time and then I wear my diamond necklace every day right here. Those are all from Missouri. They will be linked down below. But I picked up some new pieces because they looked so pretty. Okay, this is the first one I got which I'm gonna put on right now. It is like a diamond A. Like it has like a little A and I think it's so cute. So I love that. I'm gonna put it on right now. I think I got another initial. I don't know why I'm obsessed with myself, you know? I need to like wear my initials all the time. Yeah, I love this. I got a bigger A. Is it like, it's a lot of A's to be wearing, I think. So I'm gonna have to pick. But I got this bigger A too. So that's really pretty. Should I wear the little, maybe I'll wear the big one today. This one's pretty though. I'm just gonna wear this one. But the big one is really, really nice. And they have obviously every initial. Oh, and I got an S too. Like A-S, you know, Oliver Shaw, you get it. But I could also give this one to Sharin or Sasha. But I was thinking of wearing those together, which I thought would be cute. And I think that's all I got this, this round, yeah. Oh no, I got this ring. Just another stacker ring for day to day. It's like, I like these like small rings. So that's cute. And I think that's all I got, yeah just those little babies, but I love the A and the S so much. I'm gonna wear these today, but I'm gonna wear those maybe tomorrow. Anyway, that's my little 
Missouri haul. You'll see me styling. I mean, you see me wearing Missouri pieces literally every single day, every single photo, but those are the new pieces I got. All right, let's go to the office. All right, I kind of like I'm gonna die. I don't know, it's just like, this is just, it's hard to look good in this time. There's no life, I feel like there's no life in here, you know, like, I feel like everything, everything hurts, so pale, everything's so dry. <laughs> just got to the office. It's fucking freezing in here. It smells like disgusting cigarettes in here because our building is disgusting and someone smokes in the building and it seeps into our unit and everything in here smells like cigarettes it's really gross but i'm going to oh my god the lighting guys i'm so sorry i feel like i'm gonna die actually we got some samples in which i'm really excited about we're switching a lot of our production to overseas because you know after a lot of trial and error and a lot of learning you can't make a lot of stuff in canada so we did have to switch a lot of our manufacturing overseas can't make stuff in canada um, on a larger scale for a good, I don't even want to say for a good price because you actually just can't make things in Canada at a larger scale, like some, some specific items, specifically like delicates and stuff. We just, there's no facility, there's no manufacturing here. And also there's no like farming of fabrics here. So anyway, I can get into that if you want, um, talk about like that sort of stuff because, you know, we went into this being like, everything's going to be made in Canada but that's just impossible, literally impossible. So um, maybe, I'll, maybe we'll do like a Q&A or something. I feel like you guys are kind of interested in that. Anyway, got some samples, so I'm gonna open them. Oh, this looks good. This looks very good. These sleeves are a little long, I think. They look good. They look very good. I'm gonna put them on when Shrin gets here so we can share the excitement together. Shooting today. Good morning. I didn't really talk to you guys today. I just had some One second. Sorry, my contractor came later as soon as I started that clip. Okay, so I haven't been able to like explain what's been going on today But came here in the morning and my countertop was installed If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen this But my countertop was installed and then I do go to a shoot Which I have some footage and now I'm home And the big reveal of the countertop Ta-da! Oh my god, so nice. I'm obsessed, I love it. I love it so much, it's exactly what I wanted. I think it adds a lot of warmth to the space, but still has like a coolness to it. I think it goes really well with the cabinets. Still waiting on appliances, but I love it. And I got this from Stone Tile. You would have seen me pick it out. I'm literally so tired. I'm lying in my bed on the ground. I uh, thought that I showed you my outfit today, but I don't think I did. It was on my Instagram, so I'll insert a photo right here. So cute. And I just paired it with my classic little huggies. And then today I'm just wearing my A necklace that I showed you last week. I love it. It's so pretty from Missouri. I don't know. I'm, I feel like every vlog, I'm just being like, I'm so tired, but literally like, I don't know, this year is just tiring. <laughs> if you're in Ontario, I think you get it. It's been, it's been a lot here. I've just been working all day. Why do I always turn the camera and then I like can't talk? I want to show you my 
necklace that I showed you the other day. This is kind of how it looks on. I love it. I love it so, so much. I, uh, yeah, my house is a shit show because they took everything out of my kitchen when they put in this baby. My contractor's coming in a little to kind of fix some things and put some things back and whatever. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm doing. I've just been working on the floor all day. And that's pretty much it guys. Nothing, nothing really too much to report. I made some content. This is on my uh, Instagram. I am gonna change though because I'm freezing. This house is freezing. But, oh, I did buy, where is it? I bought a Google thermostat, which I'm very excited for because I have one of those like old school thermostats. You can see right there, I actually took the cover off because I was so frustrated with it. But I'm really excited for my Google thermostat. I'm gonna get a Google Home and then I'm gonna get like, everything's gonna be like all synced up and then the FBI is gonna listen to me all the time because they can literally see into my entire life. Like who cares? Like what am I doing? And uh, yeah, that's it. I have a little more content to take so I'm gonna get ready to do that. <sighs> Hope everyone's having a good day. <laughs> Good morning. I am just putting on my everyday necklace. I haven't had it on. I feel naked without it. This is my Missouri single diamond necklace. I literally had this on for the past like three years. I don't know if I've said this, but I do have a link always in my bio, my bio, my description that has a landing page to all my Missouri jewelry that I have and every time I get something new it goes onto that page so if you're ever curious about what jewelry I'm wearing if it's majority it will be on that page so I do work with them as well full disclosure so I'm gonna put this on and then it's Jonathan's birthday today he's 34 years old so <laughs> 34. <laughs> um so I'm going to go make up cakes that's what I'm doing this morning okay that's what we're making today we're making me buddy crocker rainbow bit but we're gonna make it in cupcake form. I've never done this, so <laughs> wish me luck. Bowl. I also got Cheerios, cause uh, I don't know. It just felt like it. Heat oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. For shiny metal or glass pan. Is this shiny metal? Okay, Google, what's 350 degrees Fahrenheit in Celsius? 350 degrees Fahrenheit is equivalent to 176.667 degrees Celsius. Okay. I got these because Jonathan clearly does not have any baking things at his house. And I still don't have appliances. Okay. Do you want to see it go in? One cup of water or milk. We're gonna do water. One cup. Yeah. It's a vegetable oil. I'm gonna do olive oil because I don't have vegetable oil and I don't know the difference. Two, three. Spoon and I'm going to, it says to beat vigorously by hand. Yeah, no, I can't do that, so I'm just gonna try my best. Scoop it out, pour it in. I have no idea how much should go in each, but I'm gonna fill it up about halfway. Okay, well there's definitely a problem because I made 12 and I'm run out of batter, so I think I put too much in. You might have really fucked up cupcakes, very large. Maybe my cupcakes were just bigger. Maybe they meant mini cupcakes. It's literally, I think it's 10 a.m. All right, well, I'm gonna eat the cereal while I wait. Oh my God, so good. Hmm, okay. Those ones kind of dented in when I took them out because I took them out a bit early, I think. But I don't know, I don't know. They kind of like fell, but these ones look okay. So we'll see, I'm gonna let them sit for 10. <laughs> I tried my best. 
It wasn't great. <laughs> this one. Anyway, I think that's it for me today. Clearly I won't be making a cupcakes for my kids bake sale. So. If you want to check my majority links, they're in the description. Thank you so much for sponsoring this video. Love y'all. Peace and love. Bye.